Good morning and welcome back to PowerTech TV. Here we have probably the finest of the last generation Commodores ever made, the LSA equipped VF GDS. It's the one with the lot. It's got that much fruit from the factory, it might as well be the entire orchard. Now standard, they're a good thing. Rated at 430 kilowatts at the crank, I believe. It's good for a few weeks of ownership anyway, till you get used to it. Then the key is to modify them with some tasteful mods. I want more. Not backyard stuff, tasteful, reliable, and end up with a package like this. This car here, particular car, all Harrop modifications. Harrop Stage 2 kit. Upgraded top pulley, gives it four to five PSI more boost. So up from eight to about 12 and a half PSI. Cold air inlet to reduce that negative boost or pressure drop through the standard air box. Left the standard headers on and I've done a Harrop cap back. Now this will allow us to reach the maximum output of the factory fuel system. Anything else requires that you upgrade the injectors. This customer didn't want to need that. He just wanted something cool. Sounded great. He could hear some blower wine, courtesy of the airbox, and sounded good out the back, courtesy of the cat back exhaust. So, nail this whole thing together, then put one of our custom tunes in it. Let's run it on the dyno and see what it does. Factory form, pretty impressive anyway, really, considering it's a standard car. 346 kilowatts at the rear wheels. Nice linear power curve, and as per usual on all my videos, there goes my phone. Silent now. It's probably you calling to book in for your LSA. 346 kilowatts at the wheels, where uh, stage two kit takes that to 417 kilowatts at the wheels. That's a mighty increase. And of course, you'll feel that, particularly since this GDS is equipped with the manual six speed. Torque, just as good. We're up 150 to 200 Newton meters everywhere, which means you only need a little bit of throttle to get a big result. So just cruising at 60 Ks an hour and rolling on, you'll just have massive gains. In fact, you probably won't even want to rev it as hard. It's that good. So. Nice package, neat package, takes us about a day to do, and with a superb result, why wouldn't you consider a stage two upgrade to your uh, VF GDS today?